And here we go, big winter storm system still on track. Kind of hard to believe, you know, Todd Marissa, last couple of afternoons at 61 and 63 degrees just brought a nice January thaw to the state. If anything, it just melted away all that snow from the last one. But we'll add to the snow banks once again, starting tomorrow morning through the end of the day Saturday. It's going to at least be an eight inch snowfall for the mountains, probably four inches for the lower elevations. Bernalillo, Valencia County at this point included on the winter storm watches for some snowfall accumulation. No signs of snow just yet. The clouds have certainly thickened up overnight, though. Can't rule out a sprinkle in the distance, kind of one of those mornings, but for the most part, no moisture is reaching the ground. And hey, we're in the low 40s. Santa Fe, Albuquerque, about five cooler and in there in the River Valley. Southern New Mexico, look at those mild temperatures in the 40s. Still 52 degrees right now in Roswell. Not a bad January morning at all. Touch breezy in Roswell. Winds still relatively light for the Albuquerque metro, only at about three miles per hour. But the easterly winds will be kicking up today as this next storm system does approach. It's just off the coast of California, and there's a big time moisture feed into this one. So it will bring both rain and snow. It's going to be a little warmer than the last storm, and it's going to bring some heavy amounts of moisture. By the end of the day today, here you can see light wintry mix shower is going to be possible over the northern mountains. Nothing heavy, though. No travel trouble problem. Problems. And we could have some good old fashioned rain showers across the southwest. The moisture lifts north and northeast overnight. Now, the middle Rio Grande Valley probably going to hold on to a wintry mix and some rain showers, especially south of Berlin and Los Lunas. However, we could have a rain snow mix around Albuquerque, maybe some light snow on the ground by Friday morning. And then Friday evening, you can see the snow. It holds on across the northern mountains and also for the east central part of the state. But we'll have wintry mix and rain showers for south central and southwestern New Mexico. And that still kind of applies to our Saturday. Still plenty of moisture around Saturday morning morning and during the day on Saturday, but it's going to be showers of both rain and snow for the state. Let's start to pile up the snow. Okay, we wake up Friday morning. Is there going to be enough snow for a school delay? Probably not around the Albuquerque metro, but the East Mountains and areas up along the Continental Divide, a few inches of snow will possibly be on the ground. And in Santa Fe, a one or two inch snowfall is going to be possible by daybreak tomorrow morning. We'll add to that by the end of the day Friday. You can see Santa Fe picks up a few inches of snow. We've got Vegas, Raton, and Santa Rosa with accumulating snow. Same story for the Sacramento. And these snow bullseyes right up and down the Continental Divide, they just continue to grow. And then on Saturday, by Saturday morning, you can see we still have, well, those contours of blue continuing to fill in and expand. Uh, this storm system probably doesn't wind down until Saturday evening and Saturday night for most of us. So that's all going on in the next 48 hours, but today still fairly quiet. We've got the clouds around, cooler temperatures, but hey, we're still topping out around 60 degrees for most of southwest New Mexico. And before any late day rain showers arrive to the southwest, temperatures are warm well into the 50s to about 60 degrees. Just a slight chance for a late day shower, maybe rain or wintry mix in the four corners. And we've still got the mild for January temperatures at about 55 for Farmington. Stepping out of the 50s down into the 40s today across the north central mountains. A late day rain or wintry mix shower just can't be ruled out, but we don't expect anything heavy. You'll notice those breezy east winds though. And we've got northeast New Mexico out of the 60s and into the 40s today. Uh, probably dry skies on the east side of the Sandias and the Sangre de Cristos. For the Albuquerque metro, can't rule out that late day shower sprinkle. Our highs in the low to mid 50s, hey, they're still above average for this time of year, but a full 10 cooler than yesterday. Here's a look at our seven day forecast. Now, in Albuquerque, we just can't rule out waking up tomorrow to a slushy inch or two of snow on the ground, but the east winds will try to eat that up. Uh, throughout the day Friday, and then again on Saturday, snow and wintry mixed showers will be possible. And this is going to be one of those storm systems where we just can't rule out anywhere from a one to Four inch snowfall accumulation around the metro, with the highest totals expected, of course, around the edges of the city. By Sunday and early next week, this storm system is all done, and we do expect another temperature rebound into Tuesday and Wednesday. Todd, Marissa. Thank you.